The Willowbrook experiments aim to find a cure for hepatitis, a virus that was becoming a major problem for US troops during World War II. In the early 1950s, Dr. Saul Krugman proposed developing a hepatitis vaccine and decided Willowbrook State School, which served individuals with severe special needs and were already plagued with viruses and unsanitary conditions, was an ideal destination to conduct experiments. The study began in 1955, with the school requiring parents, who had very limited options for their child's care, to consent for their child's participation in the studies to keep them enrolled. Preliminary vaccines were administered, but the experiments also involved unethical practices, such as injecting healthy children with the virus and distributing tainted chocolate milk to spread the infection faster for research purposes. While these studies led to the development of hepatitis A and B vaccines, they faced severe criticism for their unethical methods, highlighting the scientific community's mistreatment of human research participants and leaving a lasting stain on medical research ethics. In 